we felt that some textbooks in this field actually want to invite students into very arcane theoretical debates that take place among professional scholars of international relations. And in fact, what students really needed was to appreciate why theory was important. Another extreme is some people teach the subject uh, in much more narrative, empirical style, uh, e either as diplomatic history uh, or as simply empirical findings. And students can get overwhelmed by the detail and lost in it. Uh, so we tried to steer in between those, which is give students enough theory to appreciate why theory matters and why you need it in the field, enough history to appreciate what those theories are arguing about, and then a conceptual framework that helps students make sense of the connection between theory and practice or, or theory and reality. Part of the excitement of international relations is we haven't all reached a consensus on these are the most important questions and more importantly, this is the, the best way to teach it. So you want, in some ways, an open architecture textbook. So we haven't written the textbook for faculty members to simply lecture the book. We've tried to write it in a way that faculty members could use the book as a resource to generate not only lecture material, but also engaged student discussion. Because if you can get students to own uh, their education, they're going to be much more engaged themselves.